Texas Democrats have filed a federal lawsuit against Governor Greg Abbott and the Texas Secretary of State. Democrats demand that voters be able to vote by mail because of the ongoing coronavirus pandemic. They want a court to relax the rules so any Texan can ask for an absentee ballot to avoid possible infection at polling places. This is just one of the political side effects we are seeing with the global pandemic. Ross Ramsey, the co-founder and executive editor of the Texas Tribune. He is in Austin for us as always. Good morning, Ross. Good morning, Jason. How are you? Doing well. You know, uh, voting by mail is much less secure than polling places, but there's a pandemic going on. What is the governor and the secretary of state saying about this now? Well, you know, a bunch of states do voting by mail now, and the security problems are probably overblown, but, you know, that's the main objection raised here. The president was pretty blunt the other day. He said, you know, voting by mail is hard on Republicans, and you see a lot of Republicans in office that are resisting it. But you've also got the prospect of people standing in line at a time where we're telling people not to stand in line. You know, Wisconsin's election put this in high relief, and I think we're going to have this debate for, you know, at least a couple of months in Texas. Probably so. Uh, Secretary uh, State Comptroller, rather, Glenn Hager, told the Texas Tribune in an interview that the state is almost certainly in a recession. That means cuts are probably coming to state and local governments. What might go first? You know, you can't cut much in the state budget before you get to public education and health and human services. Those are the two biggest things in the budget. And if you're going to make significant cuts, and Hager is talking about billions of dollars in decreased revenue, yeah. then you have to get into those two things. We'll see, you know, when the legislature gets here in January, how they're going to go about it. All right, Ross, back to you in a moment. And Inside Texas Politics will return in a moment as well.